What are red flags associated with back pain? If you develop sudden severe pain and it's just not getting better, this may indicate a serious condition. But in addition to the severe pain, what other complaints are you having? If you have pain going down into your legs, that's a red flag. It may indicate you have some sort of nerve entrapment and you need to get an evaluation by a doctor if you have increasing pain and radiations to the legs. If you have accompanied fevers or chills, your back pain may be caused by some sort of infection. So again, based on fevers, chills, night sweats, if you have these concerns, these are so-called red flags and you need to talk to a doctor. If you've lost your ability to control your bladder or bowels, this is an emergency. Please contact your doctor right away. And if you can't, go to the emergency room to be evaluated. If you've had some recent traumatic injury, you had a fall, you were struck, you were in a car accident, you have a chance of having a fracture in your back. That's the source of this pain. If you're over the age of 50 and certainly over the age of 70, your risk of having a fracture is much higher than a younger person. So if you have a recent traumatic injury and you're older, these are red flag scenarios. Please talk to your doctor. If you've had a history of a cancer uh, and you have back pain, there is a concern the back pain may be a sign of another cancer. Now, this is not meant to uh, make you scared or make you worried or concerned, but if you've had a history of cancer and you have back pain, please let your doctors know about that. Remember, these are just signs and questions your doctors will ask you. It's likely that there's nothing too serious going on with you, but we do call these red flag indicators of potential problems please discuss them with your doctor. This is Dr. John Shim talking about red flag signs and back pain. Thanks for listening.